In this age of global standards, there is an event that showcases boldness and creativity in search for new global standards. Teenagers from around the world have gathered together here to passionately compete. The Korean Standards Olympiad was first held in 2006. The main competition featured 30 middle school teams, 30 high school teams, and 4 Malaysian and Indonesian teams. As the Olympiad celebrates its 9th anniversary this year, it has also began its path to become a major international event by inviting participants from Malaysia and Indonesia. In August of 2014, the 9th Standards Olympiad finally began celebrating young people's boldness and creativity as well as passion for science. The participants were engaged in a fierce two-day competition on ideas and standards wherein they produced one innovative idea after another. The main competition of the Olympiad proceeded with three steps, creating the standardization prototype, creating the standards portfolio, and presenting the standards portfolio. The first stage scores participants out of 60 points. The second stage scores participants out of 30 points. In the final stage, participants are given up to 10 additional points for how well they would present their inventions. Participants became curious as they listened to their instructor. They were so absorbed in the process that nothing seemed to distract them. This year's Olympiad required middle school participants to standardize various signboards using simple pictograms. High school participants, on the other hand, were given a more difficult task to create scientific water taps that can minimize water wastage. Participants cooperated with each other and began thinking of solutions. They readily dedicated themselves to the tasks at hand. Middle school participants were evaluated in terms of how many of the 12 types of signboards they were able to complete, including the visibility, originality, and efficiency of their designs. High school participants were evaluated on many factors. Whether their taps could adjust to the amount of running water in five or more phases, whether the phases clearly differed in their amount, the pragmatism and originality of their ideas, and the efficient use of the given materials. Soon, we began to see how busy the participants had gotten. One by one, the teams began to reveal signboard designs of various shapes and practical, yet unique, prototypes of water taps. Participants stayed up late as they steadfastly focused on solving the problems that they were given. The last day of the competition finally came. All the participants look nervous as they await the final phase of the competition, portfolio presentation. Participants began to present their works before an audience of fellow participants and judges. They surprised the audience with their originality of their presentations and how calmly they handled the judges' difficult questions. They were amazingly creative. As an international event, the 9th Olympiad also featured a variety of other programs and events, including K-pop and b-boy performances from Korean artists as well as traditional performances from the Malaysian and Indonesian participants. The traditional dance performances deepened the participants' understanding of each other's history and culture, which brought them closer. After the Olympiad, international participants have a chance to look around Seoul City. They visited Korean historical places and watched famous Korean Nanta performances. Of course, the highlight is the announcement of the competition results. Having conducted a thorough scrutiny of the inventions, the judges awarded prizes to a total of 32 teams. The grand prize went to Team Shinsan from Ulsan Meister High School. All the participants, whether they won awards or not, sincerely congratulated and encouraged one another. It was good, it was fun, it was an experience that I couldn't get anywhere else. The fierce two-day competition finally came to an end. This year's Olympiad also showed its potential to become a celebrated international event. It can bring together young people from all around the world who share a passion for science. 
The Standard Olympiad is open to even elementary school students in next year.